Hallo. In the garden. Um, lovely sunny day. And today I'm going to do the review on the self inflating mat from Mountain Warehouse. Um, got this recently off Tinternet. And it retails, believe it or not, for £60. I'm glad I, I didn't pay that. I think it was 22 by the time I put the discount code in and got it in the sale. Okay, um, I've tried it a couple of times um, and it's, it is very good actually. Yeah, but it, you know, it wants to be if you're paying £60. But it, it's a sort of mummy shaped sleeping bag, so I've tried it in the sleeping bag and I've tried it under the sleeping bag just to see what I thought. And probably I prefer it under the sleeping bag so you've got the feel if you like of the sleeping bag on your back not the rubber mat and um, my thought was if you put it in the sleeping bag you can't go anywhere you won't roll off it and find yourself in the middle of the night half on it half off but and um, when i put it on the sleeping bag it seemed to stay still so let's have a look at it comes with the, the pull cord attachment and also a velcro just to obviously compress the bag a bit more. Okay, and its size, um, it's three centimeters thick, fifty-one centimeters wide, and one hundred and eighty centimeters long. Um, I'm five foot ten. I think that equates to about one hundred and eight centimeters, so it's perfect for me. It's waterproof and it's lightweight. And it says when it's rolled up, it's seventeen centimeters by twenty-eight. Okay, let's have a look. Let's get out the bag. Let's see what we've got. Okay, comes with a little punter repair kit. It's handy, obviously, if you're out camping and somehow you puncture it, you can repair that. Put them to that side. Now, I've never had a self inflating mat before, so I don't know how much of it is actually meant to self inflate. But we'll give it a try. So, comes with a screw nozzle. Let's just start to unscrew it. And you can hear the air going in. Okay. So, we'll just give it a minute or so. This is real time, so obviously you can see how quick it inflates. Feel the air just start to go in there. It's not going to take very long. Just you know, what you can do, just for the sake of the video, it's probably half full of air. It's not fully inflated. What you can do is obviously on the top, it's a little air balance. So Depending on your comfort, you can put a bit more air in, or you know, leave a bit, a little bit deflated. I find it you do that a bit softer. You know, when you have it fully inflated, a bit bouncy, and you know, it's bound. You know, so I personally like it sort of a little bit deflated. As you can see, it's a mummy sort of style. Stay a bit at the bottom, so it's very easy. It doesn't take up much space. And see, see, I'm five foot ten, so I can easily wear that. And I have to say, that is really comfortable. There are going to be a lot of these inflatable mats out there. Everyone's got their favourite. Probably people have tried several different ones, and um, with some well-known brands. Um, personally, Mountain Warehouse, I do like their merchandise. Um, 
things I have got off them before in the past seem to be really good. So all in all I'm quite happy for this. I don't think I would be if I'd paid the £60 asking price because there are different other probably better mats out there but well, I think that's 25 for £25. Um, yeah, that'll do me. So obviously the deep lid, just unscrew the cap. Get the air yeah, rushing out so the cap doesn't fall off, so you're not going to lose it. You just unscrew it like that, I've unscrewed it, but it's you know, so you're not going to end up packing your gear away and then on your next trip find out you haven't got the nozzle. You know what I do, just squeeze the air, you know, you can obviously get the air going out as you're squeezing it up. Very easy. Okay, clear. Back away. The only thing I will say is it never goes back in the bag the way you get it. But it will. In, get all the air as much as you can, tighten it, tighten the nozzle back up because if you don't, it starts filling up air again. Again, I've learned that. Put the three packet in the pack. strap very easy design just a strap with velcro on all you do is just put it on there hold it tight that's it easy as that part of the way ready for your next trip if you've enjoyed that Please like and subscribe to my channel um, and we'll put some more videos on soon. Okay, thanks for watching, take care.